Good evening, everyone. Joe for Jaspi's Hobby Den here on a Friday night doing the second half of the uh, Court Kings basketball case. This is a brand new Court Kings, 1617 Panini Court Kings basketball, eight box, half case break, pick your team number two. And uh, at the end of this video, uh, there will be the randomizer for the Jaspi's holiday season extravaganza. So I'll take everybody from the first half and everyone from this half, put them all together, randomize them. And then the name on top will get an entry into our big holiday season extravaganza promo. Details on that. JaspiesHobbyland.com. Check it out. Uh, these folks right here are the guys that got into, and gals maybe, might be some gals in here, are the folks that got into Court Kings number two. Thank you very much. All right. There you go. We're talking burgers off camera. No, no, no. I mean, a nice steak. You don't put burger barbecue sauce on a nice steak. And uh, sweet tea is huge. Sweet tea is huge, although I just do a regular tea. All right. Uh, that's what we talk about, folks. If, you're, if, you want, if you don't want to miss out, you got to watch the live stream, jazbeeshobbyland.com. All right. You see, I marked these number two so you know from, from the same case. All right. Good luck, everybody. There's my knife. That's not a knife. This is a knife. All right. No? All right, that was dope. I have not worked on that impression yet. All right, we're gonna open up all. We're gonna open up all of these last. By the way, Boss Man loves shipping those. By the way, it's his favorite thing to ship. we got here we have some Patrick Beverly's some cans for Reed I don't think any of these are numbered so we're just gonna breeze by these portraits Julius Randall orange Julius 73 out of 75 we've got James Harden I don't think this is numbered out of 60 oh a guy we like to hate I don't know. I had no problem with Christian Leitner. Did you guys? There's a great ESPN 30 for 30. I hate Christian Leitner. Jersey and autograph. It's the Timberwolves edition of Christian Leitner. 12 out of 60. Minnesota Timberwolves, Pokey Chris. I hope you like Christian Leitner, Pokey Chris. Because he's coming your way. Whether you like it or not. Sketches and swatches. Your fresh paint autograph is for the Nuggets. Malik Beasley. Nuggets going to Mike Tobin. All right, one more relic on top of that box there. Nice. Performance art, Marcin Gortat. 4 out of 25 for the last spot, Mojo. Nice one, Kyle. Marcin Gortat coming your way. Nice colors in that patch. Like I said, I'm, I'm saving all of these box toppers until the end. Uh, I don't know if Nick Jaspi is still here or if anybody else knows for 100% certain. Um, the... Uh, box toppers is it one autograph box topper per case i think that's what kyle was thinking and that's what i thought too but that might not be the case that might not be true that may just be rumors and innuendo malik beasley for the nuggets again out of 175 there it is 169 out of 175 Paul George, it's not numbered. Diallo, Sheik, Check, Check. For the Pelicans, Relic, going to Pokey Chris. See, 
See the Nuggets logo there? Yep, there's Jamal Murray, Art Nouveau for the Nuggets. Denver Nuggets, Mike Tobin with that one. Not numbered. And we've got, wow, sketches and swatches, Andrew Wiggins. Three color patch and autograph, Andrew Wiggins for the Timberwolves. There you go. Big hit for Pokey Chris. Nice. All right, uh, I'll do this box right here. Remember, we're saving the box hoppers until the end. Yeah, nice hit, Chris. There are those guys. For the Jazz, Rudy Gobert, 118 out of 175 portraits. There's Gordon Hayward Maestros. And there's Artistic Endeavors, Carmelo Anthony, 32 out of 149. Relic. Nice. Oh, yeah, it was David Nelson that doesn't like these cards. I think the I like them. For the Clippers, freshman paint, 25 out of 200. I guess, I guess Dave Nelson also does not like Pollock artwork. I think they're cool. They've got like this oil painted look on there and this looks like canvas too. Next box. You, th you, you think the, the 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 painting is a little haphazard? It's modern art, folks. got for the Cavs, portraits, LeBron James, nice. Yeah, BTV likes the look. I do too. Six out of 25. It's like a Pollock. So for the Cavs, that'll go out to Jackie with the out of 25 LeBron James. We've got Maestro's Carl Anthony Towns. That's just an insert. And another Cav, right here, Expressionist, LeBron James. See, get it? Expressionist. 137 out of 149. Uh, Dave Nelson's using team colors, not just some random Photoshop color swatch. I don't know, I kind of, I like it. This is very polarized. Every year we do this, there's, there are people that are like, last year people were like, ah, oh, Court Kings looks terrible. And there's some people that, that, that love it. Freshman, uh, fresh paint, that is. Torian Prince. Good Baylor guy, huh? I like that on-card auto. Nice one for Atlanta. That'll go to Sean. Now we brought with that. But see, I'm, I'm the guy that also likes Diamond Kings, too, and Gridiron Kings. So I like the whole Kings set that Panini does. Do 
Dwayne Wade, Chris Paul. Hi, Lauren. How's it going? <laughs> did you get Did you get the train whistle, Lauren, from from your dad? Monish Nobly portraits. Out of one double oh seven, do 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 do. Out of one seventy five, Mono Ginobili. The answer. Cool insert there. Oh man, I can't say that. Art Nouveau, Timothy uh, Luwawu, Cabarro. I think I got it. Sixers relic, going out to Pokey Chris. I think I'm close on that. I think I'm, you know, I got pretty close. Nice. That's our second Brandon Ingram autograph. Out of this case, air apparent. Nice on card auto for my boy Brandon Ingram. Forty six out of one fifty. Nice. Here's the thing: if you end up using the team colors. On that, what happens is it just, it kind of, it's too matchy-matchy. That's an official phrase that they use in design. Too matchy-matchy. Can't do that. 46 out of 150. Nice, Brandon Ingram. Who's got the Lakers? Who's got my Lakers? Pokey Chris. Lake Show. Is your guys' video freezing? Hmm. All right, welcome back, folks. Unpa video unpaused. Oh yeah, the answer was the last card that I that was on top of that pile. So there it is. That's not numbered. And then I think after that was Brand. Do we see Brandon Ingram, Lakers? Forty-six out of one hundred and fifty. It's on the video, it's recorded, so. So you'll see it on the video. But there's that Brandon Ingram for Pokey Chris. Nice. Did we see this guy? I couldn't pronounce his name. All right, there we go. And I think, I think we're, I think we're back. All right, three boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, there we go. I think we're back on track. All right, next one. And Todd's all caught. Okay, good. Everyone's all caught up. And now, I, I hear that... Uh, Lauren got a, got herself a train whistle today, Todd. Good. I'm glad. I'm glad. That's important. There's Kenneth Fareed, Blake Griffin, Jalen Brown. Malik Beasley. Ricky Rubio portraits. 168 out of 175. Haven't seen any thunder yet, I'm afraid, Jay. Not yet. Maestro's insert. Kyrie. Al Horford performance art, 166 out of 249. Nice relic there. Maui bra with that one. And ah, you can you can use the entire canvas. My friend, Thon Maker, 164 out of 200. That'll be for the Bucks going out to Milwaukee Bucks, Mike Rose. I do have a wooden train whistle. But if I get a train whistle, it'd be like one of those big, like, they'll, they'll uh, set it up up here. And there'd be a big chain that I'd pull, like, you know, like a big steam train whistle. Otherwise, it'll just be, just be from the throat. 
the vocal train whistle. All right, two boxes to go. Um, and Dave Nelson, if you're still listening, of the products that were released he this year, what product do you like? I don't think you like any, I don't think you like any product that's been released this year. There's Nicola, Nicola Batum, Christoph Sprzingis, Jamal Murray, Prince, and for the Grizz, Rookie Portraits, Wade Baldwin. That's out of 175. Nothing from Panini. What about Tops? No, of the of all the releases this year, what 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 has what is actually like met met the muster? Cut the mustard? I don't know that phrase. There's D'Angelo Russell Maestros. So of the Tops products, then anything from Tops? That's that caught your eye. Kobe. Vintage materials. Another one for Pokey Chris and the Lakers. 51 out of 149. And see, see, you guys, I know they're rookies. But they'll learn, but they can use the entire canvas on this. 37 out of 200. DeAndre Bembry for the Hawks. That'll go to Maui Bra. Nice one, Sean. Dave Nelson likes Futera Soccer and Gold Label. Oh, okay. All right. All right, fair enough. I had the impression that you disliked everything this year. Ain't or just those two, Dave Nelson, that's it? Bowman likes Spectra football and Playbook football. Those are pretty good. We did a lot of those breaks. All right, last box, ladies and gentlemen. And then I'll pause the video to do the randomizer for the Jaspies holiday season extravaganza. That Tony Parker, I felt like was numbered. It is eight out of 25 on that one. Spurs with that numbered card. Rick Thomas with that. Jamal Murray, and there's Malik Beasley. We got JJ Berea. 10 out of 175 for the Dallas Mavericks. Mavs card going to Vic. Maestros, LeBron James, insert. We've got Jakob Poltel for the Raptors. Relic. Jackie with that one. Aha, there we go. Dave Nelson's, I'll admit, preferred basketball is okay, except for the patches. All right, last one. There you go. Fresh paint for the Grizzlies. Nice. Wade Baldwin, 48 out of 200. He's using most of the canvas. I like that. Good job. Memphis Grizzlies. Mike Rose with this on-card autograph. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, that's not it. I forgot. I forgot myself. I Here I was reminding everybody that's, that I was going to do these at the end. I forgot myself. Come on, Joe. Just it's a Friday state of mind. This is what's happening to me. First one is Jason Kidd. Nice. It says rookie royalty up there. Nice. And Kyle's saying it should be, there should be an auto in one of these, right?
We got rookie year 2009-10, Tyreek Evans, Kings version. There it is. Uh, Sacramento Kings, that will go to uh, Vic. Oh, by the way, in case you were wondering what the, uh, just for scale. That's how big those cards are. So you can just kind of see scale-wise. I know it's kind of out of context without all the all the other cards. Nice, Scotty Pippen for the Bulls. There you go. Look how young he looks there. Chicago Bulls going to Jeremy 33. Who's who's Jeremy 33 because of this guy? A little history from one of for uh by one of our regulars. There you go. That's the story. Come on, man. There we go. We got Kyrie. For the Cavs, there we go. Nice. So there's there's the uh, there's the artwork up close a little bit. Hi, Kyrie. There he is. There's another bull, and that is Jimmy Butler. Autograph? No. There's Jimmy Butler. Another one for Jeremy 33. And the Chicago Bulls. We got Steph Curry. I do not remember this Warriors logo. Do you remember this Warriors logo? I do not. No autograph on this one. There it is. Who is this guy? I'm, I'm assuming a Warrior, but... All right, Warriors goes to Pokey Chris. Two left. And I'll pause the video really quick to set up the uh, randomizer for the Jaspies holiday season extravaganza. Nice. Spud Webb. Autograph. Nice. Spud Webb on card auto. And that goes to Maui Bra. Sean. Nice. There it is, Spud Webb. There you go, the, the 5'7", 1986 NBA Slam Dunk Champion. Nice, we'll set that aside there. And the last one, there he is, Sean, nice. Oh, G-Say Dubs, appropriate name, says, unfortunately, I do remember that logo. Can you tell us more about it? Like, what's it about? Who is that guy? What's his history? We learned about the Brownie the Elf the other day, which was an Elf logo that the Cleveland Browns used a long time ago. There's Carl Anthony Towns. Another nice box topper there. Very cool. And that's your break, folks. All right, actually, I'll keep the video running. Man, I almost got a guy to buy a case again. <laughs> Ooh. All right, so that's break two. Uh, let me bring, where's the, where's break one, Court Kings one, there it is. So there's Court Kings one right there. You can see on the top of your screen, there's Court Kings. Nope, you can't because I didn't change screens. There's Court Kings two. There's the spreadsheet for Court Kings one. Let me grab a clean list here. So we'll take everybody from Court Kings one. It's not too crazy to go to the restaurant now, right? No, 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 go, go, go. 
And uh, Court Kings 2 is right here. There's Maui Bra all the way down to Kyle. Let's add those names there. So there should be 60 names total. And this is for the Jaspies Holiday Season Extravaganza. 100 winners, grand prize, $5,000 of break credit. All the details, jaspieshobbyland.com. That's why this is such a big deal. All right. Uh, seven times for that list. Oh, but first, G State Dubs. Nice. We got information. Sorry, more suspense. G State Dubs says he was the mascot named Thunder. Oh, and then had to ditch him when OKC came around. Oh, okay, well, there you go. There's the story. Seven times for this list. One. There's 60. Two, right? Right there. So I did the list right. Three. Four. What did I say? Seven. Okay. Five. Six. Six times right there. And name on top gets an entry. Is a winner. Good luck. Seventh and final time. Pokey Chris. After seven times, Chris Z. One of our longtime regulars here. Gets an entry into the Jaspies holiday season extravaganza. There you go, Chris. Congrats. And thanks to everybody who filled up these last two breaks of Court Kings basketball. There is more on the website, jazbeeshobbyland.com. So let's do more. This is Joe. We'll see you next time.